YouTube, what the crap's going on? Ice for the ice court, bears for the bear throne. Welcome ice. back. We're going to continue with Kislev and um, continue dominating, hopefully. Um, we've got Kastalton healing up. I believe Hannibal Barakas is also kind of healing up. I'm going to leave him there for a turn. Let's see what else we got going on. Leblia, he rebuilt. Making decent cash at the moment, all things considered. Because we have a lot of armies. But it's good that we have a lot of armies. It's allowed us to kind of branch out and keep ourselves from getting beaten up so much, like has been typical in some of my Kislev campaigns prior to this, where it just ends up being extremely difficult. All right, let's go ahead and end this turn. Pick up a little cash afterwards. Um, there were a few more comments. Uh, so I'm my recording this before you all have watched the last episode, so I don't have like your newest comments from that one. But there were a few comments I didn't get to on the last one that I'll get here. Uh, one of them is from Francesco Lagoya, and by the way, thank you for being a channel member, Francesco. He says, wow, things worked out in the Slanesh realm. Yes, they did. We did not get tempted out for once, uh, <laughs> even though it was tempting to continue to take that money. I think that non-aggression pack and some money from him. Um, so yeah, definitely. Thank you, Francesco. Out there, the assassin says, I'll keep watching. Don't worry. Well, I appreciate it. Thank you. And for all of those of you who are watching, I asked this on the last episode, and I'll ask it again. If you are watching this, not a lot of people are. There's a ton of people mad at Warhammer, so that put views down. The algorithm hates me, and that also keeps my views down. And then also, I'm competing against a whole bunch of full-time people on YouTube, and that's fine. I like those people, I'm saying I dislike them. Um, but, you know, I need your help. If you're going to watch these videos, I need you to not just watch it and step away. I need you to hit the like button. I need you to leave a comment down there. That helps me out a lot. It's okay. not... I don't think it's much to ask. If you all think it's much, you can tell me to shut up. <laughs> but I I could definitely use the help and would greatly appreciate it. So thank you for those of you who take the time to do it. Um, however many views is how many you know interactions we could have you will choose to participate, and then that would drive up my views a lot because the algorithm would think that I've made something clickbaity, and then it would start giving it views because the algorithm loves the anything it thinks is clickbait. Um, speaking of clickbait, one of my I highest viewed videos people. recently, and this is like disturbingly sad, queen. is the one where I talked about how the roadmap sucks. Isn't that bad that the video that gets you the most views <laughs> is the one about how the roadmap is trash? That is unfortunate. Um, you know what? I'm going to auto-resolve this. I'm not sure why it thinks that this is going to go so swimmingly, but I'll take it. Porridge flows in our veins. Thanks for the uh, extra cash, losers. Lord there are some orcs nearby, but I don't think they'll be stupid Never enough to attack leave. either after just seeing what happened to the stronger force from Nurgle. But we never know. It does look like we've lost a couple of units in this army, though, so let's get some global recruitment going. I'm going to start um, putting in a couple of heavy, well, let's get one I heavy sled, merge these ones. And let's get another heavy sled. I demand absolute that leaves one unit. Um, we had a Frost Maiden in this army, did we not? She must have just gotten wounded. Yeah, she got wounded. Okay. So we'll put the Frost Maiden back in when we get the chance, but that's why we were missing another unit there. All right, so I'll have to put the Frost Maiden back in momentarily when she's healed. That fear alert, what are we working on? So we got skilled craftsmen, so that's gonna upgrade our sleds. Meanwhile, this Frost Maiden was successful in the last turn, finally, at ridding us of an enemy agent. I won't have enough chance succeeding this turn. We've got the cash, so let's build the buildings. While we have the opportunity. This one's real expensive too, but we'll go ahead and drop that one. I got rid of most of our money, but we can go ahead and build here. Really? I have enough money to build here? Uh, I probably want defenses at Castle Alexandrov, and I can't afford it, so... We'll build it on the next turn. Boris is moving up into the former dwarf territory. I'll try to reclaim some of it, though. We've got to be careful. If we reclaim Friends the uh, settlement, 
Um, our army will be weak for a while. I'm not going to join the war against the vampires right now, but nice thinking, Boris. Love other Boris. <laughs> what are you all most excited for whenever the um, Immortal Empires gets here? I, I take it you all saw the short trailer. I didn't make a video about the trailer because Reborn. it's a short well, trailer. Um, I feel like we already knew they were going to call it Immortal Empires, too. Did they just siege me as well? They did. Nope. Wow, these guys just don't know when to quit. I'm gonna kill off some of my gold chevron ice guard if I do this, but I really don't feel like fighting that. I'll just re recruit them. You know, get the heck up Hot off me, people. Labor. Just leave me I be. Deal. I reject any who crave power. I deserve a larger retinue. There we go, so they'll give me my ice guards back in a couple of turns. We're gonna be replenishing anyway, so it's not a big deal. I just didn't feel like wasting time on those green skins. There wasn't much to see there with their army. With rally. With this, my rule is absolute. And speaking of that reminds me, I need to go fix the mount on Zarina Katarin's Patriarchs. Let's get into the character details. None shall question me. It's not on his war bear for some reason. There we go. He's less chosen. Everybody else who can be war, mare, war bear mounted is. So that is good news. Serena Katarin is ready to attack Doomkeep. My role, my decision. And then Kastalton. Great victory. Uh, we're gonna have to build some towers. Continue they the siege. death. Castalton's still healing, so let's push Go! forward, keep healing. Go! Let's take a look at those buildings again. It was here? We need to build. Yeah, we need to put some defenses in at Kaxel Alexandrov. Upgrade the fort there as well. Let's do that. There is a let's Legion of Chaos army at Castle Alexandrov. I do have some Empire Garrison there, which could help. Take a look at Boris. Boris Ursus he can no longer move this turn, so it's fine. Of I think this Patriarch is the one who was wounded when I sent him down, wanting to close the rifts. But uh, let's go ahead and go close this one here. It's a little bit close to home. It's already a Cornate army that's come through it. I don't have the funds to close it, so let's do it on the next turn. And our income just continues to go up. Okay, well, that stinks. We got sieged at Castle Alexandrov. We'll see what the auto resolve looks like. like the I guess I could swing Boris back that way, because I don't want to have the Legion of Chaos make any inroads my into my territory. Okay, I'm going to declare war. Let me bring it on. Seems like a bad idea there, Maggot. Hey, it was his name. I called him Maggot, and Maggot is his name, so... Feels like a well-deserved name. I think the extra allegiance with Sterling, that might be helpful. All right. What does this look like here? Okay, it's gonna give us the win here. Thanks to those garrison from our empire friends. I take the extra cash off that because there's no other enemy armies nearby. And let's use that. And we can go to the tier five building here. Nordland, we can improve our defenses, improve our port. It's gonna be almost everything else. I'd like to get that building there for a little bit of income. High priest of Urso. Well, we don't have enough money to settle this settlement either. I think I'm gonna actually just for move up into an ambush stance here. Sight. Let's see if we can catch this army of. Chaos Undivided that's walking around. I am truth. Repel Chaos. Castalton is ready to attack the Forbidden Citadel and try and retake it for us. And circle it. Make them suffer a little casualties. Let's see what else we got going on here. So, our Patriarch has leveled up. We're working on Soothsaying to make their aura bigger. 
I control the frosts. Wherever winter asks. You miss clicking that guy. Suffer winter's bite. Can't seem to get lucky and actually May knock him out. The frosts. Frost Maiden's back here, so let's bed her back into that army. And then after this turn, we should be healed and have the new troops. There's a pretty large army I'm in here with Kronos. That is a lot of burning chariots, and he's got a couple of lords of change. So that's a pretty powerful army. We want to be ready to knock that one down. Okay, so they're going to sally out against me, it looks like. Yeah, they're attacking us, so let's fight this one. Folks, battle's getting started. I'm going to actually run my sleds forward, and I'm going to back up the rest of these units here. And give myself a little more room to fire. In fact, we're going to put our flank up right there. I'm going to take my heavy sleds forward and start to open fire. Try and slow down the Legion of Chaos. They've got a lot of troops. Because they've got their garrison with them. I don't think they're really going to be able to win the battle, considering what we've brought. Brought to bear. <laughs> oh, gosh, the lame jokes. They don't stop, folks. Get them up. Let's get our elemental bear out in front. Same thing here. So see, now we've pulled them back a little closer to our missile fire, and that is definitely my objective. Oh, no, no, not you. Right there. Let me get out here and intercept. My chariots. Let's get in here and start smashing up these demonettes. There is a seeker coming in after my bear out here, so let's pour some fire into it. Okay, keep my war sleds moving. All right, so we got hit by some Seeker Chariots over here. That's unfortunate. Let's slow these units down. Throw some heals here with Kostoutin, because we are getting hurt pretty bad up in this fight. And I need... I don't have enough wins of magic for the Heart of Winter. We need 24. That's not ideal. So we're taking some pretty gruesome damage at the moment. Getting hit by a lot of enemy units. In fact, my elemental bear over here is probably going to be defeated. I think I can get it away alive. Yeah, I'm going to lose my elemental bear. That sucks. This is a lot of Slaneshi units, though, and I had to use it to try and block. Oh no, is it going to get away? I think we can get it away. I'm going to get it away with 180 hit points, I hope. Don't go in the forest, you're gonna get caught. Ah, this is Herald of Corn keeping up with me. We're wounded and it's hurting us. Oh no, he's gonna catch us. What's the speed on that Herald? Oh, what a bunch of crap. That Herald of Corn is gonna die a thousand deaths. Speaking of die a thousand deaths, I'm working on that at the moment. Really, you know what would have been nice is some winds of magic. CA, please. A little more healing with Castalton. Ah, oh, we are getting savaged pretty hard here. I don't think we're gonna lose the battle, but we're we're feeling it. Let's keep our war sleds moving. Should have crystal sanctuary that elemental bear over there. That was a big mistake on my part. Get the stout and after that herald of corn. There we go. Our bear is about to be freed up over here. All right, so we turn the tide. That was a brutal battle. Probably one of the tougher battles we've had in a long time. So that was fun. It's Harold the Corn, though. I want him dead. What he pulled, killing my bear out there. 
It's gonna cost me several turns of recruitment. Look at him summoning stuff over here while he's the only unit left. Get your cheese out of here. Filthy Herald. Alright. Got my sleds headed out to cut down the fleeing foes. <laughs> Get him, bear. That elemental bear and polar bear. It's the bear dyad. <laughs> How is he still alive? He's being shot, hit, crumbling. Everything all together, like... I do not understand how he's alive, and the Castalton is almost dead amongst that. That's crazy. All right, there we go. All right, well, we got savaged a bit there. We lost a couple of units, but we'll be okay. Uh, I'll go ahead and take replenishment, and we're going to take back over the settlement here shortly that Zeej stole from us. So treacherously. Bring it on, Nakari. Didn't know we weren't at war. All right. So we should be able to take the Forbidden Citadel quite easily. Army receives the plague, yeah, that's why I've got the better Bow Steep mod, or else we'd never be able to accomplish anything out here. I'm gonna kill another of my Ice Guards in the Auto Resolve, of course. Let's go ahead and occupy this settlement so I can go ahead and start getting those losses taken care of. So I'm going to need a, an elemental bear. So let's take a bear. And I lost an, a, a Kassar with spear. And since I'm going to be recruiting for a while anyway, rather than bring back the Kassar with spear, um, we'll just go ahead and replace it with an ice guard. And we lost one of these ice guards. So there we go, that'll put us up to full strength in Castalton's army. Be a bit expensive for that global recruitment, but oh well. Giant home mountains, we can rebuild our port. And Hannibal Berkus oh, yeah. is holding the port. The Zinch army is about to come ashore. We gotta hold this settlement until we can build it up a little more. Put in some income there. Build the defenses. Income. Uh, you know what? No, we need the anti... I don't have the money for it, so we'll get it on the next turn, but we need the uh, building that's going to stop the spawn of portals. Or rifts, I should say. Frost Maiden here has leveled up. Arcane Conduit. Earthing and Heart of Winter upgraded. Castalton. Still work on lightning strike. Let's finish lightning strike and then skilled craftsman. A gift from the bear. Are we ever going to be able to assassinate all these fight. guys? Not yet. We picked up a warhorse from that though, because she leveled up and got the warhorse, so that's nice. Let's finish off specialist. We don't really have much cash, so I'm gonna skip that. Let's take a look at Sarina Katarin. Yeah. She's still working on some construction here. Continue that siege. There we go. I might fight that siege battle. That'd probably be kind of fun, to be honest. Say that. They don't always end the up being super fun, but I think it'll be good. What's up, friend? No, I'm not joining any wars. But thanks for asking. Very kind of you. I always appreciate friends trying to drag me into a good war, you know, so that total war can be more of a total they war. Speaking of total war, let's knock out Doomkeep, shall we? Yes, we shall. Okay, folks, the towers of Kislev are advancing on the walls of Doomkeep, and I've got my heroes headed in to take out the gate. Wow, those towers are absolutely a gruesome affair there. A little bit frustrating. Um, yeah, looks like we're gonna make it to the walls just fine though. And I'm at the gates. 
Yeah, they, when the AI summons, they seem to always just like go running back to their own territory too. Really rather strange decision. AI looks to be abandoning the walls at the moment too, so also a strange decision. So I'm gonna get onto the walls. Took out those units. I'm gonna move my ice guard up closer and hopefully they can fire up and over the wall. My Streltsy can rain fire up onto the wall. Let's take a look at the towers here. We've got plague bearers of Nurgle waiting on us. Some weird lag there. I've got ice guards coming off of the towers over here. I'll turn them, point them down, and fire on the wall. Let's. This armored Kassar there could be in some trouble. Alright, so I'm gonna start getting into melee with these units. One of my armored Kassars is probably gonna die. Oh my towers, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Like, they're just deleting my units here. Wow. Try and get out of that arc of fire. I'm gonna have to get up like right on the gatehouse to avoid it. You guys break the gate? Like I hope to break the gate. Okay, they broke the gate. That kind of sucks though because we got deleted right there. In that crystal sanctuary. lose some of my troops on the wall, but hopefully not all of them. Okay, I've got a big blob up here with Zarina Katarin. Let's get the heals going. Mohama Discord. Summon the cats. And Heart of Winter. Okay. Awesome. All right. We fight for Ushan. Thank Fighting on the walls. Part of Winter's coming down. That's going to clear out most of the defenders there. Crystal Sanctuary will have helped a lot. All right, yeah, the gates are mostly clear. Cannot be. Kislev loses ground. Kislev loses ground? I'm not really sure what you're talking about there, Zarina, but I'll go over here and take this guy out. Let's watch the double cat attack on the Herald of Nurgle. Those are our bedazzled snow leopards. <laughs> Oh man, they, they haven't given up. There's still quite a few defenders here. Alright, so that Herald of Nurgle is going down. My units on the walls have done pretty good, all things considered, because they were up against pretty powerful infantry. Another heal going. My Frost Maiden's needing some heals. I'm gonna hawk some Miska here because it's not gonna hurt the friendlies. Drop that out there too. So we have annihilated almost all of the defenders. Got one of their leaders here that was on the Seeker Chariot. I've got an exalted Keeper of Secrets rolling in now. High highs and all. Defenders of Kislev! A fight strategy! Slay these land ones! Comrades of the bear! Okay, there we go. That exalted keeper of secrets ought to get just kind of bogged down by sheer numbers here. And then its lack of armor will make it pay a price. I've got these Kassars up on the wall. I'm gonna try and have them shoot that. Keeper of Secrets. I've got some 
spawn coming in. Nice, the keeper is almost done. Looks like they're still trying to summon. I think the power bar is going to sour against them here momentarily. Yep, there it goes. That's going to be it, folks. Spawn are unbreakable, but everything else is going to crumble out. And then we just have to finish off these spawn who are taking some fire from the walls now as well. That's going to be a successful capture of Doomkeep, taking the capital from the Legion of Chaos from Daniel. I think that's what everybody calls him. Daniel the Demon Prince. There it is. All right, we lost one armored Kassar. Um, not a huge deal there, especially considering how much garrison we were up against. We'll take it. So Doomkeep falls into the hands of Zarina Katarin. She can train war bear riders here. Now that's interesting. I haven't re-equipped her army for quite a long time. I think I'm going to do it as well. Um, we need to train some different stuff here. She's going to need heavy sleds. And as much as I love me some Streltsy, I've got Ice Guard. I'm going to just kind of cut some of these units. I didn't look around me to make sure there were no enemy armies first, but okay, now we look safe. Um, let's see, I'm going to go ahead and train a few War Bear Riders, which will make this army stronger. And I'm going to get one more Ice Guard each. And that leaves us with one opening here for her army. I'm going to trade over to Heavy Sleds. You know what? Let's get a little Grom, just for fun. Let's grab let's grab Again, little Grom. We serve the mother and then as I get more money, I think I'm going to trade out those Light Sleds for some Heavies as well. Yeah, that'll, that'll be something different and hopefully interesting there to pull in little Grom because we None haven't really messed with it me. much. This campaign, let's get some defense built. And don't have enough cash for the last thing. Finish some more um, research. Let's see exchanges. Come from ports. Ammunition for war sleds and little grum. It's gonna take a while, but let's go ahead and do that one. Is that a. That is definitely a reference to Araby. CA, please. We stand Give us Araby. What are you waiting on? Do it, you cowards. Seeking Over power. here and enter an ambush stance. Make that town look kind of vulnerable. Frost Maiden levels up. Assassinates. And then our Patriarch levels up. Specialist. Okay, so... Boris looks like those Chaos sailed away. Let's just let them... Uh, actually, I may need to beeline it. No, 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 we saved Castle Alexandrov, so... Good there. I don't have enough cash for that. Frost Maiden. They will fear me. Failed there. Get that, and let's end one more turn. It's been a good episode. Took back a couple of settlements. Well, took back one settlement and took a new one. They want military access. I'm okay with that. Whoever they're fighting, it's probably worthwhile to let me fight them. Hope you all are enjoying the episode. Again, make sure you get a chance to click the like button if you liked it. If you didn't like it, click the dislike button. And then, of course, make sure to leave a comment. Uh, happy to see all that and get your feedback. Appreciate your interaction. Air of Carthage signing out for now. I will see you all soon back in the Kislev campaign.